Dean, this is a tough place to play. You likely got their very best shot. What did you learn about your hockey team tonight? Well, we learned we could play two different games, I guess. Um, uh, it was such a fast game early and for the first half, and then it turned into such a heavy game. Like, man, they, they were everyone was competing. You talk about desperation. I mean, it, both teams were really desperate, and, um, you know, it's, it was really really good for our group to um, obviously the, the result was there but it was a good group, uh, thing for our group to compete like that in both ways. How about, how about just the way that you guys defended those last three or four minutes? I mean some hard plays yeah. using guys like Alchanyuk out there and, yeah. you know it's pretty impressive. Yeah I, you know what I uh, honestly I think we could have went to anybody I mean that's the way the group was playing I mean you know we have to make a decision uh, uh, you know on, on who we want out there obviously but um but I think we could have went with anybody out there and they would have done the same thing, throwing their bodies, paying the price, um, each and every guy. So, um, we, yeah, the, I mean, we hung on a little bit there at the end, but uh, uh, we were so committed, so it was good to see. You had such a, start, a tough start to the season on the road, a one and eight, and uh, you know now all of a sudden with six wins in a row on the road, 14 wins in your last 22. What, what changed? Uh, well, I... Just we see like the team just being a team. They 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 enjoy being around each other, um, and I think that's like you get on the road. That's what you do. You're you're together. Um, and they, uh, if anybody, I don't know, and you guys probably weren't down here, but the, before the game, like the energy was just. Uh, Megan actually said to me, she goes, "Boy, they're loose." <laughs> and and I, I I'm like, "Oh, geez, I hope they're not loose." But but they they were they were like excited, like they were having fun, and um, you know they were they were all into it. So um, I think that's probably uh, Mike the biggest thing. Mm -hmm. Ways to go, but just to to get a reward for the strides the team's made, the run it's been on to get into a playoff spot for tonight, maybe tomorrow. I mean, what does that mean that you know to finally see some headway for what you guys have accomplished these last few weeks? Um, we gotta get ready for the next game. <laughs> um, you know, it's just it, that's it. It, it. The game was great. It was a fun game. It's over. Um, we got to get prepared for the next one. Uh, just the, um, what made you put Cunny up on that line? Um, you know, as opposed to another center or putting him, you know. Yeah, you, you know what, we, we, we juggled around some thoughts. Mm -hmm. um, uh, last night we, we threw around a bunch and then we, we actually said, like, we were at the game here, our, the Iowa game, and, and in between periods we, the, all the coaches sat around and we chatted about it and obviously talked to Billy and, um, and then we all thought about it and came back this morning and thought that that was the right uh, the right combination um, for us. But same as you asked before, I think if we put somebody else there, probably probably would have been good too. Mm -hmm. Does it, does it uh, feel that this East, was, the rest of this game is going to be like a playoff game for you guys and it helps with the intensity? This time of year, I think every game is for every team. I like Everybody keeps saying, you know, your team's desperate, but... Every team's desperate. This is this is an incredible league, incredible league, and if, even teams that are mathematically or are, are not in the playoff picture, they're desperate. They're uh, guys play hard. I mean, it's uh, it's it's the best league in the world for a reason, and uh, every night's going to be a battle, uh, obviously, right to the end.